Y'all, I really wanted to love this headband unit. welcome back to my channel this is stephanie nicole a so as you saw from the title and the description we are doing yet another headband wig review so this unit was actually sent to me by me fly on wigs and this is the pretty pink bag that it comes in and this is the box that came in the bag so let's just open this up and get to all the specs of this unit so in the box comes the unit this little silver headband it's like a velvet material wig cap two clips, edge brush, and then also this tube headband, which is in leopard print. All right, so here is the unit. So this is their curly highlighted headband unit. So as you can see, those pretty highlights in it. So the color is 1B30, and this is an 18 inch unit. And it claims to be beginner friendly, which I believe all headband wigs are beginner friendly. Um, density is 150%, it's 100 percent virgin hair cap size 22.5 inches so it's about a medium size um, they do sell lengths that range all the way from 14 inch all the way up to 24 inch and for this 18 inch unit is 170 dollars so a little more on the expensive side but that's okay we're going to try it out and see what it's looking like so as far as the construction of this unit standard construction has three combs in the front so two on the side one in the middle also one comb in the back, adjustable straps in the black headband piece. So I'm gonna go ahead and put the unit on my head and then um, put some products on, see how we could get these curls to pop. So I already have them on my wig cap and my silicone headband. So I'm gonna go ahead and throw this on. So just keep watching. So I'm just gonna slip this unit on my head and place the comb that's in the back of the unit in the nape of my hair, and then attach the black headband piece with the Velcro. So straight out the box, I am in love with this curl pattern and this texture. So now I'm just sectioning off the hair so that I can spray the hair down with water and then apply some curling cream just so that I can see exactly what these curls look like. So I'm just using my spray bottle and spraying down the hair and then finger combing through and then I will be applying some Cantu for Kids curling cream and just running that through the hair as well. Also, I'm using my detangling brush that I got off Amazon. So I'm going to do this whole process all throughout my head. So keep watching. So immediately you can see the hair getting kind of limp and a little stringy, but I'm going to finish what I started and power through. So there is a huge difference between the wet and dry side, but we'll get into that later. All right guys, so I am back. So I just wet down the hair with my spray bottle and then also used my daughter's curling cream again. So this is the Cantu for Kids curling cream and then combed through it with my detangling brush. Now I will say that there was quite a bit of shedding with this unit. So as you can see, it's a lot of hair in this comb. All right, so let's get into some styles and then I am going to be back with my honest opinion. So let's get into some styles. So first style, I'm just gonna part the hair on one side and flip it over to the other for a flip over. And now I'm just gonna gather the top half of the hair and secure it with an elastic band for a half up, half down. Thank you. 
And now I'm just gonna take the hair from the ponytail and twist it around for a top knot with the rest down. So now I just wanna try out this leopard headband with all the hair down. And now I'm just gonna pull the headband back for a different type of down look. And now I'm just going to pull that headband forward for an updo pineapple look. And now I'm just going to throw all the hair up to the top and secure it with an elastic band for a high ponytail. And now I'm taking the hair from the ponytail and twisting it around for a top knot. All right guys, so I am back. So when I started my YouTube channel, I said in my very first video that I wanted to be transparent and this review is going to be very transparent and honest. So how I feel about this unit, I wanted this unit way back in November, I think of last year, before I even started doing reviews of headband units, I really, really wanted this unit because I saw another YouTuber review this unit. So it was sent to me, I was super, super excited. I will say the color on this unit is gorgeous. The um, 1B30 highlights is very, very pretty. However, this unit claims to be virgin hair. Yes, it was virgin hair at one point, but to get to the color of the 30, it does have to be lightened, which is processing. And with processing, it kind of changed the texture of the hair. Like I wish I would not have put any kind of water or product on this hair. It was very pretty before I added water and product. However, Am I never supposed to wash my unit? So as you can see now, the texture is, I don't know, it's not the type of curly unit that I would wear. So also with processing the hair, lifting it to that 30, um, to that 30 color, you have to bleach the hair. So it kind of transformed the texture of the hair and the hair is, I don't know, it seems very weak and um, I don't know, I'm just not a fan of this hair. I'm not a fan. Um, and I hate to say that because I really wanted to try this unit, but it just seems like the hair texture has been compromised due to the lightening of the hair. So yes, the hair sheds, yes, the hair tangles, all of the above. And curly units that I have reviewed in the past, I've never had any of these issues. So I'm really shocked and surprised by this unit because I was so in love with it, just seeing it all over YouTube and seeing it on their website. So I am very disappointed and, um, yeah, that's just my honest opinion. I have to give you the truth. So $170 for this unit, that's a little steep um, just because the quality of the hair on this unit has been compromised due to the processing. Um, the curl pattern of this unit is really not the best to me. Someone out there may love it, um, but it's just not for me. So unfortunately, that is my review of this unit. So that is it for my review of this unit. I'm gonna put a playlist down in the description box of all of the headband units that I have done thus far. Make sure you check that out. I'm also gonna put a link down in the description box of this specific unit. If you love it, make sure you check them out as well. But um, that is it. So make sure to like, comment, subscribe. And as always, I will see you all next time.